I shall tell you of mean Uncle Willie. But who is he, actually? What do you know about him so far? Not much, I reckon. You know that he lives in a cabin in the woods all by himself, that he's smoking and drinking all the time, chasing everyone away with his belt. He's really a mean, hostile and grumpy old fart. His soul is pitch black and his heart is filled with anger and hate, exploding into wild rage every time he feels provoked. He's a psycho, a lunatic, an egomaniac, and an unforgivable sinner. That's exactly why they call him mean, Uncle Willie. But why did he become like this? That's the story I'm about to tell you, or at least I'm gonna give you some clues. Just take a look at this. I can remember my first love, my greatest love, my only love, the one I lost. But still I can feel her in my heart. I hear her whispers in the wind right now, whispering, I love you, I miss you, please come and find me, but how? I can still see her everywhere, her reflection in the water, her eyes in the sunset, her face appear in the moon, she smiles at me like she used to, and it makes me cry in the rain, and it feels like her tears are mixed with mine, just like the rain carries her tears, running down my cheek. Heaven only knows how much I'm missing her, knowing I had heaven in my hands, and I let it slip away from my fingers, like golden dust in the wind. And now I get down on my knees, praying the wind someday will bring her back to me, not only the whispers in the wind. I want the whole girl, heart, body and soul. Dear God, is that too much to ask for a sinner like me? Please bring her back and I will sin no more. My heart will finally be free. Get back on your feet, soldier. Who's that? Mama's calling. Mama's calling my ass. Don't you know? It was her that took her away from me. She killed her. She drowned her in a bucket of water because she's crazy. Hey, listen to me. Where are you? Show yourself. Mama's calling. Go now. Ah, what the heck. I got no time for sentiment anyway. I'm no crybaby. I'm freaking Uncle Mean Willie. And I got a car that needs some fixing. Who's there? My poor little graceful monkey of a son. Get up and come to mommy. Mom? You here? Hell yes. It's me. Come to mama, you son of a bitch. Ha <laughs> You calling me a son of a bitch? What does that make you? A bitch. Yeah, you got that right, you bitch. Where the fuck are you? I'm right here. But you're dead, ma. Aren't you? Yeah, I'm dead as a door. Why the hell did you come back? I came back to show you your past, all that you have lost. Ha! You're the one to blame. You killed my girl. No, you did, you crazy maniac. How dare you? How dare you? Ah. Why don't you rot in hell? <sighs> and let me be! How dare you talk to your mother like that? Fish. Get! Get away from me! Hush now! Get, I said! Get the fuck away! Shut the fuck up, you crazy bastard! Ha! Look who's talking! Hush! Mama's calling! Why don't you come to mommy? No fucking way! Not if you talk to me like okay, that! Okay, son. I'm sorry. Ah, you ain't sorry! you never been sorry! You can't fool me! Get, I said. I have work to do. Come, or I will curse your ha! ass. You always were a witch, but I ain't afraid of you. I Not will anymore. curse you if you don't come. Oh, really? Really, really? All right, then. We can't have that. 
can we? It's up to you. You got awful stinking rotten greaseball monkey. Oh, and now it's that tone again. You want me to come or not? Come now. So where the fuck are you? Just follow my ways. All right, all right. If that's the only way to make you leave, I will come. Where are you? Come. Where are you taking me? Back to your childhood, where it all began. All right, all right. Lead the way. Hey, what is this shit? I'm glad to see you too, son. Well, I don't really see you, though. Just that freaking shadow. Tell me, are you for real? Are you a ghost? Of course I'm a ghost. What else could I be? I'm dead, goddammit. All right, all right. You're a freaking ghost. Fair enough. Why don't you get to the point? Patience, son. Sit your ass down, and I will tell you everything. Everything? That's a whole lot, mom. That's too much. I don't think I have time for this shit. I got a car I need to fix. Ha, ah, you silly brat. Your car is a freaking wreck, and it will never run on the road again. No matter how much you screw on it. So screw you. Oh, well, I know that, mom. I'm just passing time, you know. It's just for show. <laughs> Entertainment only? Hell yes, my point exactly. So, can it wait? I guess. Hey, why don't you get to the point? This shit is after all a little bit creepy. And it's cold out here. I like to get back to my wine and make a bonfire. It's freezing cold here. Can it wait? Yeah, I guess. But why don't you get to the freaking point, man, before this conversation turns into a verbal loop? Round and round we go, getting nowhere. All right, I'm gonna refresh your memory, but sit your goddamn ass down first. All right then, now put your money where your mouth is, and don't waste my goddamn it motherfucking time. Before you put the blame on me, let me remind you about your father. How he used to beat your sorry ass every night. You remember, don't you? Uh-uh. No, hardly. I spent all my life trying to forget about it. He was drunk like a skunk every night and beat your ass with his black leather belt. But one night we both got enough, so I chased him around the house with a shotgun. But he attacked me, he grabbed it. I fired a shot, but I missed. And then he drove me back, and, and he drowned me, you know, in a, in a bucket of water. Well, you ain't no better, man. It's the exact same thing you did to my girlfriend. No! You did it! What? No, no! It can't be! It was you who did it! You're messing with my mind, you witch! No, no, son! You're the one who's been lying to yourself all your life! Hell no! That's fucking bullshit! Get away from me, you witch! Get! As you wish! But the truth remains, you can't change it. God, did I really do that? No, can't be. That I've been lying to myself all the time. I know my own memory. You're lying. You're the liar. Tell me the real truth. Well, I just did, son. It is the truth. Ah, whatever. What happened later then? Well, you ran away from home, don't you remember? I found this cabin in the woods where you lived in total oblivion. You created your own past, your own memory. But the pain was still there and you have inflicted it on so many others, right? Well, I guess that's fair to say. Yeah, there you go. 
Oh fucking shit. If this is true, how can I live with myself? Well, that's up to you to find out. There may still be a chance for your redemption. You can still save your soul, but you got to change, son. Totally. And you got to do it fast, or you will burn in hell. Yeah. But how? Hey! Where are you? I don't see you anymore. Where are you? Ha! Ah, this was just freaking bullshit. There are no such thing as a ghost. Maybe just something that I ate. Fuck this shit.